Yeah, I know the lighting sucks, and I know I'm ugly barefooted, but I just wanted to show you this snake skeleton that I found the other day. And yes, it's broken in half right there from one of the videos that I tried to make of it. I accidentally broke it. But I'm not going to fill my face or anything because I have a black eye and it's real ugly. Plus, it's hard to see because of the gray sky. But that's the snake skeleton that I wanted to show you guys. Like, see, there's no head on it because the skull's gone. Like, maybe that's the head or something right there, but don't look like it. Also, I, I love snakes, but I'm just not going to touch it because it's a dead skeleton. I don't want to get a disease or anything. Some meat on it still. That's the main reason I'm not touching it. I have to wash my hands real good. Wash my iPod with electronics cleaner because I accidentally touched it. Here, I'll touch it just a little bit to move it. Okay, there. Ew, that's gross. Okay, so. <clears throat> with my hand. I know my hand's swollen. Because it's hurt. Uh, that's how long it is compared to my hand. Compared to a... Uh, uh, I don't know, like, I'd say seven inch hat, no, like, I don't know, I'd say about a f seven inches long hat, it was like that. So, I just thought I'd show it to you guys, because it's kind of weird and kind of cool at the same time, it's how long it is compared to my foot, and my foot is six inches, so six inches, that's about two or three feet. And there's a lot of reptiles because I live in Kentucky. I live on a hill. There's a lot of vegetation and crap, like a broken tree over there. I, I never, holy crap, I never noticed that, that water tower. I never, ever knew that. Wow. But I just thought I'd show it to you guys and... Be looking forward to for more of these videos because there's a lot of reptiles on here. I think my next video will be about one of the some of the lizards that I catch. See you guys next time.